It was a day of gloom for the Indian market as the Sensex fell below 16,000 levels for the third time this year due to weakening rupee and deteriorating macroeconomic conditions. A political impasse in the United States over reducing debt and a ballooning European debt crisis also weighed on investors' minds. The Sensex fell 425 points or 2.6% to close at 15,946. If you can see on the chart, the index has fallen almost 22% since the November peak. The fall in the broader market was even worse. The BSE 200 index hit a low of 19.35 today and is down 25% since its November peak. The Indian rupee touched 52.15, its lowest level since 2009 March, as oil importers purchased more dollars. Technical analysts said that the rupee crossed the 52 level and may slide further without intervention. Back in India, the India's most valuable company, Reliance Industries, dipped 3% to Rs. 786 after the government said that it was taking action against the explorer for decline in output from KG D6 field. Bharti Airtel fell over 2% after CBI registered a case against the company and the government officials for irregularities in the 2G spectrum allocation. Banking stocks considered a barometer of the economy, also saw heavy selling. ICICI Bank slipped the most. It fell over 5% to Rs. 732. And the largest lender, State Bank of India, dipped 3% today.